Hey everyone, I'm Drex, and this is the Two Minute Drill brought to you exclusively by Order, the connected asset visibility and security company. See every asset and protect against threats. Order is a great way to find and eliminate blind spots. Find out more at thisweekhealth.com slash order. That's O-R-D-R, thisweekhealth.com slash order. On the two-minute drill, we do at least three stories at least two times a week, all part of one great community, the 229 Cyber and Risk Community here at This Week Health. Thanks for joining me today. Here's some stuff you might want to know about. Let's start with a very brief update on the Ascension ransomware attack. The health system still mostly offline, but they say they're working hard to recover systems. Uh, everyone seems pretty tight-lipped on the details beyond those I've talked to you about in the past couple of two-minute drills. So like you, for now, I'm mostly watching the updates as they're posted at ascension.org. Patching is a very big deal, and I know I harp on it a lot, but trust me, I also know how difficult it is to do it well and do it right in an environment that's filled with legacy and complications. But having said that, here's one that probably needs your attention. Apple released patches this week for 14 security vulnerabilities found in older iPhones and iPads and 16 other vulnerabilities in the latest iOS version. Apple also shipped updates for all the versions of their desktop operating systems too. So if you've been putting off that OS update, please don't. Start the download, do the upgrade, walk away, get a big cup of coffee, whatever it is, you know, let the updates wash over you. Trust me, it's absolutely for the best. And speaking of operating systems and other software with security problems, Microsoft is being called to testify to the House Committee on Homeland Security. Brad Smith, Microsoft's president and vice chair, has been asked to jump in the hot seat on May 22nd. We'll see if Microsoft hits that date. It seems like lately when Congress calls folks into the principal's office, the students kind of show up whenever they want. But when he does show up, legislators will likely grill Mr. Smith on a pair of reports from the Cyber Safety Review Board describing nation-state intrusions into its core platforms, pointing at cultural and technical defects at the company. For its part, Microsoft has just recently kicked off an effort to restructure their cybersecurity governance model, calling it Secure Future Initiative, it's intended to create more secure Microsoft products by making security the top priority above all else. I'm hopeful, but I'm also not going to hold my breath. Given the depth and breadth of products we all use from Microsoft, using security to try and turn this giant ship won't happen overnight. So stay paranoid. And the Wall Street Journal just completed a survey of 300 compliance professionals asking about the top risks their organizations face. And surprisingly, not really surprisingly, cybersecurity came in at number one, followed closely by regulatory scrutiny and enforcement and the risks associated with digitization of the business. Those surveyed said cybersecurity was one of the biggest areas where they needed to build skills and hire staff. My two cents is that the finding and hiring parts going to be tough sledding for several years. So keep looking to great security partners to help fill those gaps. And thanks again to our partner, Order, the exclusive sponsor of the Two Minute Drill. Order continuously identifies and classifies hard to find unmanaged assets, eliminating blind spots. Check out Order AI Chasm, available now in the AWS Marketplace. And don't forget, you can download the two-minute drill wherever you get your podcasts. Just search for This Week Health Newsroom. It's tucked in there with a bunch of other shows I bet you'll like. And uh, if you like what we're doing, we'd appreciate it if you left ratings and comments. And that's it for the two-minute drill. Thanks for your time today. Stay a little paranoid. I'll see you around campus.